hey guys what is up from the video title you can see that today i am giving you two makeup looks for valentine's day one right here is going to be a nice soft like innocent girl makeup look and then the next one is going to be like mm, snapped she like went all out she was bold like nighttime like party you know so two different looks right there so without further ado we are going to start this video but first make sure that you subscribe put your bell notifications on share like and comment for what you want to see next all right so i did my brows i might go back in and reconceal them because i think i made them a little too thick and i don't like my brows a little thick i like them to look quite natural anyways um i'm like very bad at introducing myself when i do my introduction anyways my name is chiffon if you didn't know if you're new here i see that i have quite a few new people so my name is chiffon i am a college student so yeah that's like just the basics you know all right so the first look we're gonna do is the soft like good girl look okay so we're gonna start with eyes first and we're going to be using Warrior 2 by Juvius. We're going to be using this because this is really the only palette I have. And I have another one that we might be using too. So we'll see though. But yeah. So to begin, I am using the Laura Geller New York Spackle Concealer in Tan. And I'm going to prep my eye. I just use my finger and make sure your finger's clean. And I just tap it all around. So... To begin, I want, I'm actually posting this video this week because, I'm posting two videos this week because, guys, I freaking hit, I'm almost at like 700 views on my shower video. And I was like, oh my gosh, I like did not expect that at all from my shower video. And I was really shocked by it. I was like, wow, like little old me over here has almost 700 views on that shower video and i was just like wow that's so amazing and then my newest video that my soft glam video that i just recently post it almost i think it has 20 views and that's just in two days and normally like it takes me forever to get like a like a decent amount of views so yeah i was like why not just give them like an extra video this week because um i like like got all those views and then there's also a bunch of new subscribers and like oh my gosh so thanks for being a part of chiffon's little snippets and yeah that's why you guys are getting an extra video this week and i was like what should i do what should i do and i was like why not do makeup like a because you know valentine's is coming up this friday so hopefully i can edit this really fast because i'm not that good at editing and um not not that i'm not good at editing but i'm not good at like my turnaround like doing it fast in deadlines if that makes sense so that everything like lines up so i want to try and get this up before friday so you can have another video this week and also so that um it's up before valentine's day because these are valentine's day makeup looks so yeah, um, I'm about to just moisturize my face with Vaseline because it's a little dry. And yeah, I don't have like a moisturizing primer and I'm a broke college student so I'm using Vaseline. It honestly works the same. So yeah, I just did that really quick. Okay, back to your eyes, my eyes. I'm going to take just like a little brush like this oh it's dirty a little brush like this and i'm gonna set my eye to brush i'm doing the fit me like press powder and it's in shade 322 golden caramel you know guys i have like a really hard time like picking like my powders and my foundations and stuff because in my last video like i wore that foundation to prom and like it was fine but i just feel like now like it just doesn't match my skin color and i don't know why but i just feel like i need a new foundation or something because i just feel like it doesn't match me anymore and i'm just like i look really pale like do you guys think i looked really pale in that video 
maybe it was just me maybe it was the lights i was using oh my gosh the lights in the last video were also really off and crazy so i'm so sorry about that like literally i liked doing that video but like i need like ring lights and all that stuff and like also i just did like a like a really quick like fast forward video type of thing because like sometimes if i talk and i do my makeup like the video is super long and i don't know if people like that so yeah but anyways okay so now i'm going into my brushes i really badly need to clean my brushes they are so dirty but now that i have a clean canvas for my eyes i'm grabbing one of my brushes from the it brushes from ulta and if this brush is a shadow brush so i'm just gonna wipe it off really quick because it's kind of dirty and i need to clean my brushes I don't know how to clean my brushes in college though because like I need to go to the store and like get something because I don't have like a makeup cleaner or something here so when I go home for spring break I'll probably like get some so I can stop using dirty brushes because that's not good and bacteria builds up on them anyways let me stop rambling and talking <sighs> okay <clears throat> the first shadow that we're gonna use is this one right here it's the Dyra shadow this one we're going to apply this all over the eye it's gonna be a nice little soft pink look my sophomore year i used to love doing colors i used to do orange colors like all the time because i just thought they were so cute but then i ended up stopping i don't know why i ended up stopping but i just did for some reason but honestly i'm not going to try and make this video like too long because first i'm doing two looks so there will be some like fast forwarding in between these looks definitely because like i just think it's cool to do like more than one type of look in one video and like they're super simple too that's why i'm putting them together like i'm not doing anything crazy or outrageous so yeah so i'm gonna just like place this all over i want to just thank you guys so much because like literally when i first like when i in august when i first posted a video like i was like i don't even know if people are gonna like me or like if this is even gonna work or like because youtube now is just so different and i was just like i don't know if i can like catch up or like be in the game or whatever but you know i was like how about i just do this for fun and for me and i just see where it takes me and where it goes because honestly i don't care <laughs> i'm just doing it to do it for fun and like technically i'm gonna like for what i want to do with my major and stuff like i'm gonna be doing videos and like i need to know how to edit how to edit audio like how to combine combined videos and how to like effectively like make them cohesive so like this is honestly helping me for my future and my major and yeah because like um this semester i'm actually in a news class for editing videos and an audio class for editing audio that's something that i don't have i don't have a microphone but i need to get a microphone because i know you guys probably can't hear me or feel like i probably like talk weird or something i don't know but uh yeah we're gonna place this all over the eye okay so we're done with the first color now we're gonna grab our second color um this is hashtag slay the brand is makeup revolution i got this like a really long time ago for christmas so yeah um i switched to a smudger brush and i'm going to use this darker pink color right here what was I talking about? I think I was talking about school or something. I think I was. But anyways, I am placing this in my crease area to make it deeper. I'm placing it and bringing it all the way to my inner corner. Ooh, that's cute. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of coming up with this like on the limb. I know you guys are probably like, girl. We get it. You think it's pretty. But you know, I'm trying here, okay? So now we're gonna grab, oh, we're gonna grab the brush from the other color and we're gonna blend it out. So comment below what you are doing for Valentine's Day. I was really about to start. What's wrong with me? Oh my god. 
that. So comment below what you're doing this weekend for Valentine's Day. All the sweethearts, all the non-sweethearts, you know, just comment below what you're going to do. I need some ideas because I'm here at school, so, you know. Okay, now I'm going to do the same thing to the other side. Alright, now that I did that, I am going to take the, my concealer and I'm going to like semi cut my crease and I'm using a concealer brush to do this. My pressed powder and a small brush and just a pack like a little packing brush and so that it doesn't um crease. We're gonna just paint things all over that oh god girl that looks so good okay so now we're gonna take bh cos bh cosmetics carly bible bible palette so uh my nephew got in this palette and uh it's a little uh <sighs> messy but i still use it because i really like this palette and she did a really good job on it i'm gonna use the color that's up here it's like almost gone and i'm just gonna use my finger these are so buttery so where i cut the crease is where i'm gonna put it so cute it looks so shiny okay now i'm gonna do the same thing to the other side so i'll be right back so i'm just gonna go back in with the Daria, however you say it, I'm going to go back in with it and I'm going to just go over it with the top and blend it out a little bit more. So... I just do what did i just create <laughs> i'm just kidding this is so simple it's not even funny okay for my lashes because with my face i'm not using any uh foundation so now for my lashes i'm gonna use the same lashes as my last video don't mind that i'm using kiss lashes by naked drama the naked drama collection last couture and it's in the style chiffon that's my freaking name chiffon so i'm using these ones because i feel like these are really flirty so i feel like i should use these ones for this look <gasps> i just dropped them all right these are my lashes they look so cute i think they match the look really well and um yeah so now we're gonna go on to the face so i already moisturized with vaseline bring it up to the bridge of my nose i'm gonna do my chin I'm gonna do my nose my forehead I don't like a lot of concealer on my forehead at all, so I am completely fine how this is right now. And then any other spots that you may have that you want to just like conceal like makeup. I love contour, contour kits. And I'm going to use this color right here. It's never too late to change your love. flat top brush and we're gonna start buffing it out okay normally i don't even put on this much concealer i really don't like like when i notice that people have on makeup i just like on their face like foundation wise so that's why i really don't like put on a lot but for this look i guess it, it like works or whatever but i'm still I just like I feel like I have a hard time like finding my shade so it's like I don't know 
sometimes I feel like makeup doesn't look that good on me but I don't know I don't know what I'm trying to say here just don't mind me do you guys think that like for my contour kit I could use some of those colors as concealer because some of those colors are not dark enough to get to contour with so I'm like I'm gonna conceal with them I think it's fine honestly like bro I love how I did my eyes like like wait a minute hold on I know I look crazy but I just bro I fuck I mm. <laughs> did that you just did that on okay now we are going to tell you we're not gonna bake i don't bake i just put on palta and i wipe it off because baking just makes me look ashy like no i can't do it so i don't bake i just put on powder really quick and then i take it off just to set my under eyes and where else i put stuff i don't have bronzer so honestly if my if it moves it moves i don't care so again using the pressed powder i have can i have translucent powder but i just don't feel like using it at the moment so we're gonna use a more fluffier brush like i said all of my brushes are dirty and yeah we're going to go in under my eyes The Kylie Bible palette. I'm gonna use ooh, focus. I'm gonna use this in the middle. I can't see this one. There we go. It's so cute. Okay. <laughs> um, a lip liner from NYX Professional Makeup. It's the retractable liner. Oh, natural. I'm using natural. And I'm gonna outline my lips with Ulta's automatic lip liner in Coco. I think I was supposed to put this one on the outskirts because it's darker. Yeah, I was supposed to put this one on the outskirts because it's darker. So, I have this. I'm not putting it all over my lips. I'm not crazy. I'm just going to put a little bit on my lips. Just, just a tad. Just a little bit. Just to make... Because I would wear like a pink color with this look but I don't have pink mmm this tastes good this is from Revlon Ulta HD matte lip lip color nude and wax color and I'm gonna put it in the middle you gotta improvise sometimes but anyways I'm gonna use the revolution sport fix for my spray brush to put on some shimmer we're gonna use on this one right here from her palette i don't really like a blinding highlight again i like natural looking things obviously my eyes don't look natural but that's different you know what i'm talking about like with my face like face wise like i like my face to look pretty natural and not like cakey and like bad you know if that makes sense look at the glow guys look at the glow Okay, we're gonna put a little bit on my nose. Okay. <sighs> okay. So this was the first look i really like it i really love my eyes i'm not gonna lie like i would wear this look um i just really like this look like it's just so pretty i think like with the colors i did and everything and then with the eyelashes and everything i really like it so 
Now, if you're still watching, I hope you are. Now we're going to go on to the more sultry look. The more like going out clubbing girl look. So yeah, like the good girl look, you know? And now we're going to go to like date night look. So yeah. So midway while I was taking off my makeup so that like, you know, not my makeup, but just like my eye makeup and my lips so that I could start the next look. I realized I didn't take a thumbnail picture with that makeup look on. We're gonna go on to the second look. It's okay. I will survive. It's all good. We are going to use Revolution Makeup Revolutions London eyeshadow palette for this part. Color right there. That one. I don't understand how hard it was to take off your eye makeup while you have a face done and your lips it was really hard but anyways it's, it's fine so we're gonna take that color and i'm gonna put it on my end right here your smudge your brush and we're going to take jamati this nice burgundy rich red right here on that color look at that pack 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 it on pack it on pack it on pack it on hey pack it on pack it on then shadow brush again and we're going to take the juvia's place palette and we're going to go into shot shot we're gonna start at the edge again and we're just gonna like build it up and move inward okay and then we're gonna go to this side with the black we're gonna blend this out what color oh the color from the makeup revolution we're gonna grab that color again and i'm gonna blend out with that color all right, so now I like how it is and I'm gonna do my other eye. Okay, so now I'm done with, oh my goodness, excuse me. So now I am done with both of my eyes. I really like them. And now we are gonna put on different lashes or whatever. So I'm putting on Ruzu eyelashes, 100% human hair eyelashes i've never worn them before so i'm gonna i think that this is gonna be really good for this look so we're gonna put them on and then i'll come back okay that was a little bit of work um i don't really know if i like these lashes compared to my other the other ones i have um i don't know what do you guys think i don't know if i like them they i feel like i have to curl them i feel like they're straight like they're not curved like at all i feel like I don't know. I might change them because I don't. I don't know. I don't know. But on to lips. So I'm going to use NYX Liquid Suede. That's going to be my center. I'm going to use NYX Professional Makeup Pin Up Pout. And then this is my lipstick. And then I'm going to also probably use a little bit. I'm not sure I'm going to use this because it, it looks kind of pinkish and I want red. And I'm going to use the Melting Pot by CoverGirl. So we're going to try these out. First, it's going to outline the lips. Oh, these eyelashes. They're kind of like poking my... Like the sides are kind of like poking my eye. <laughs> This type of red like looks cute on some people but on me i feel like like no like i could never
ways comment down below which look you guys like the most uh now tell me if you would wear one or two um i think i would wear both of these looks like i just like them both so i mean you gotta you gotta do both sometimes but yeah comment down below which ones um you think you would wear and yeah thank you guys so much for watching remember to thank you much so thank you so much for all the support and remember to subscribe put on your post notifications share comment tell your friends you know and yeah so